Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and today we have the release of the um, update previews, which is the update for week D, or the fourth week of the month, which are bug fixes and new features mixed in for Windows. So on Windows 11 24H2, if you're on a Copilot Plus PC, this contains tons of new features, a lot of AI features are enabled uh click to do and the recalls now for everybody and there's tons of things that are happening uh including um voice search of all sorts and tons of, of of features anyways on copilot plus pc machines if you're not on a copilot plus pc which is the majority of people there are quite a few uh, little things also that have been um changed one of them is that now the search which wasn't all everybody. I had it, I think, already, but a lot of you didn't. The search was on the left side of the screen, I believe, in Windows 11. So when you were on the settings for the search, you had uh, the search on the, the left side. Now it's centered on the screen at the top. Um, another feature that's here, and we're going to talk in a different, um, a different um, video uh, specifically, is that in the um, if you go into the advanced options uh, into the recovery, you'll see that now there's an option for quick machine recovery. This is added. This is now part of what Windows calls uh, Windows Resiliency Initiative, which is a quick way to have your PC start again if it uh, crashes. And this, of course, has to do with the famous uh, bug that happened um, last year that crashed tons of machines that you know we couldn't basically couldn't um do anymore uh anything because it was just crashing and blue screening and so on so this is to try to make your pc come back by uh, doing a little diagnosis of what's going on and connecting to the microsoft servers and fixing whatever is happening so you can actually start your pc again there's also an uh, easier way now to do so use Windows Search. The Snap feature, which is the feature when you try to uh, snap uh, different apps together. You see that the Snap feature was trying to find a way to you know do things for you. It's apparently improved. Um, some File Explorer um, bugs have been fixed. Um, one is more option in File Explorer. Um, the drop down menu might not display completely sometimes. Uh, the uh, fixed also dialogues in some of the uh, file explorer and the sync um, features also. Desktop icons fixed if you pin on your desktop some apps, uh, some might not display correctly, things like that. Um, so there's quite a few little things that have been uh, fixed. There's a stability issue also. Uh, in rare cases, ever uh, installing the uh, May 2025 security update. Um, subsequent updates causing devices to experience stability issues that has been fixed, stuff like that. So quite a lot of fixes. Now, this is optional uh, right now. It will be uh, installed with Patch Tuesday updates in August if you do nothing. But if you'd like to have the new features, you can go and check out your Windows updates. Uh, it comes in the form of the update, which is uh, KB5062660. It says update preview. The reason I don't recommend necessarily to install it immediately is that often they have bugs. And so they fix these bugs before they are officially released on the Patch Tuesday updates. That's why I, I say it's not, you know, maybe not a good idea to install them immediately. But if you do, well, you can go and check it out. This will bring your Windows 11 24H2, uh, which, if you look at the WinVer command, to uh, 26100.4770. 26100.4770. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.